So one of the big issues that we need to address is balance billing or surprise billing. Where a person goes in, let's say emergency room, they might even be unconscious and it's not in their insurance network and their health plan pays the same amount they would have paid had they gone to a network ER and then they're sent a bill for hundreds or thousands or tens of thousands of dollars. It's a consumer issue. We've got to get the consumer, the patient, out of the middle. Two years ago I sponsored legislation. It passed the House, did not pass the Senate. We worked on it again this session and we'll work on it this interim. One of the things we're looking at now is an arbitration model where we get the different stakeholders together and it goes to an arbitrator and they decide what's fair payment. The whole point of it is to get the patient out of the middle. So the federal government is looking at it, but they also often look at a lot of things and don't do much. They actually might do something this year. Washington just passed a, a law last week so we're, in fact, we are just having a discussion. One of the things I like about this uh, conference is the, the hallway discussions. I'm talking to some people about balance billing and uh, they shared some ideas of things that we can do. For example, if you're a provider and you're out of network for somebody, if you want to bill that person's insurance, then you have to agree to accept whatever that insurance plan pays you. Or you tell the patient, I'm out of network, I'm not gonna bill your insurance, but you have to tell them that up front.